this is really important because this is what we're up against is the cell danger response. And this is Navio's work. Again, you gotta read this stuff over and over again. This is, you can tell a lot about a person's brain by their graphics that they create. But this is his simplification of the cell danger response. But basically the short version of it is CDR1 is something bad is happening. What, what is happening? Okay, there could be a stress, an injury, a toxin, an infection. Something is like turned on the mitochondria and the mitochondria are going, yikes, not good, not good, not good, not good. What are we going to do? Okay. And then they do what I just said. They start to create inflammatory stuff, cytokines. They start to cram fatty acids that are damaged into the membrane. They start to generate oxidative stress. Once the situation's over, now the virus is gone, the injury is over, the infection has been resolved, whatever, right? Then you go through this restorative phase where you start to repair things and remodel and rebuild. And then you go into the cycle, right? So now the cell's back to normal again. But for a lot of our patients, they get stuck in one of these phases. They get stuck in CDR1 or CDR2 or CDR3. And so the mitochondria are just like cycling in this negative feedback loop, sometimes even though the original stressor is gone. And this is what we're up against. So we have to figure out where are the, you know, what stage of this are the mitochondria at and then how are we gonna fix all that?